This is uh, the grinder, <laughs> it's called. It's a 2011 Pinotage from South Africa. Um, Pinotage is a, is a grape that's kind of a, a signature grape from that country. It's a cross, a hybrid grape, a cross between uh, Pinot Noir and Sanso. Um, one of the grape scientists in uh, the university in Stellenbach created this cross uh, back in the 20s. Um, but it really didn't take off uh, until the 60s when everybody started recognizing it and, and planning it very widely. You know, the idea was to match the, you know, the full-bodied character of um, Rhone wine with the, the, the ripe fragrance of Burgundy. <laughs> and that's, you know, in some ways that's kind of uh, what this grape does. It, 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 it creates kind of, sort of a medium-bodied wine with some nice complexity um, and a lot of flavor. Um, but th what this one has, and what a lot of them have, but <laughs> this one very, very distinctly, is a real dis distinct uh, coffee characteristic. Um, you know, they're aging them in toasted barrels, and it can give them sort of a roasted nut uh, aroma and character, along with um, berry fruit and, and uh, you know, other, other much more uh, <laughs> grape-centric flavors. But, yeah, and you smell it right away. It's, it's sort of a, a toasted, roasted uh, coffee bean. Um, along with sort of um, a pretty uh, blackberry, black cherry note. Dusting of cocoa, maybe. Let's taste. It's, you know, it has the um, sort of the lush, soft forwardness of the Pinot Noir. Um, but then it has that, that richness and that, um, <laughs> those roasted coffee notes um, that are much more uh, Rhone Valley. And um, nicely balanced, easy to enjoy, uh, very forward, even though it's a young wine, a 2011. You know, this is something we're going to drink now. We're not really going to age it and expect it to um, change much or develop much, but it's really very appealing. Um, I guess it's a good breakfast wine, right? It's, it's, <laughs> it's like coffee. No, but anyway, it's it's a wine that would go with all kinds of simple foods, with burgers, with pizza, with you know, just kind of everyday fare, um, and unique and enjoyable. Enjoy.